I've heard this from several multimillionaires, that your income follows your personal growth. Your income follows your personal growth. And you know what I thought, now that's stupid. Your, your income should follow your hard work. Well, yeah, but personal growth determines whether or not you work hard. 98% of the population is dead or dead broke by the age of 65. 2% of the population is financially independent. How in the world have we been conditioned? Who in the world conditioned us to think that we can give this much effort and get that much result? Prior to getting started in Danny Johnson's training system, I was in the home business industry for about three years and literally made no money. I plugged into the Danny Johnson training system, first steps, also Dynasty, and within my uh, first 100 days, I was able to generate over $50,000. Uh, my first year became a six-figure income earner. I was overcomplicating my business for two years with absolutely no results. Plugged into Danny Johnson, and within the first year, it was making a six-figure income. My closing ratio now has been actually raised up to about 50% or higher when I actually lead somebody to a presentation. For a whole year, I made nothing until I came to this event. $20,000 in 90 days. People are not loyal to products, they are loyal to people. And it's the person that has the ability to pull the best out in others are the ones in a recession that are going to be truly recession proof. You'll be the number one recommended person for whatever it is that you do based on how you do it, people. Hey. Why is it that in this industry that there are some making millions of dollars and there are some making hundreds of dollars. What is the only variable here, folks? You. I got a hold of her website and started listening to her free training and the free training she gave me literally changed my life. Then from there, I went on to have my first five-figure month, that's over 10,000. Danny offers a system that is not on trial. She delivers results. You are not the issue in this equation of prospecting and closing at all. Who the issue is is the prospect. What do you do for a living? A corporate recruiter for um, a telecom company. What did you like about that? Putting people to work. Really? Yes. Now Great all of job. you would blow it right there. Uh -huh. <laughs> you pretend like you did not hear it. You write it down. If you're face to face, you log it in your memory. But you do not blow it right here and now. You're speaking the language, the body language, the tone, the interests of the prospect. It's important to learn how to communicate the way that they communicate and that's how you motivate them. I came to Danny, I learned the people skills and how to focus on other people. And I came out of there and my check went to over $6,000 and I had been struggling to barely make $1,000. I went on to a six figure income working from home. 99% of prospecting is nonverbal communication. 1% is, is verbal communication. 99% is where you coming at them with are you in the way with all your fear and your guilt and your worry and, and your I don't know and this doesn't work and that doesn't work? Are you coming with doubt? Are you coming with unbelief? Because that is what you are communicating to the person on the other end of the phone. You are not looking for perfection. You are looking for results. Saying that when I get really good at this, then I'll make those phone calls. No, you will not get good at those phone calls until you step out on faith, pick up the stinking phone, and pow plow through a couple hundred people. I plugged in my team into her training system. I went up to six-figure income. Um, watched my business go from nothing to over $180,000 a month in volume. And um, it's just been an amazing ride. So if you haven't been to Danny, you got to get here. you got to get your people here because I promise you, you will see a huge difference, not just in yourself, but in your team as well. Don't live life by default. You have to live it by design. And if you don't decide what that design looks like, you're going to wind up with whatever the media has sold you. Your belief about your future will be challenged for the rest of your life. It's time you get in control of what your belief is instead of letting outside circumstances determine what you believe here and now. When I look across the desk from somebody that I am showing them a business opportunity and they have needs and I know what we have gives them a chance to fill them, what else better do they have going on? What's better than the chance to fulfill the needs, the calling, the desire, the passion that they have for their life? What do they have? Nothing.
nothing better than this industry. I got plugged into the work at home profit zone system and by using that training system I ended up attending a training event. Come out of that event and made $15,000. My second year earned $120,000. I still work part time from home. I use this system exclusively with my business. She showed me specific techniques on how to actually get clients started in business, how to, how to bring clients on board, how to get them started and to help them to be able to have success. I've gone from making a couple of hundred dollars to um, close to $5,000 a month. Part of my business, I've been in business about six months and really didn't do much with it. Since First Steps, yeah. I've made $8,000. Same time I plugged into Danny Johnson, First Steps to Success. In the last six months, I've generated $49,000. Plug into Danny Johnson, go to First Steps to Success, and watch your life completely change. Either I'm gonna live my life according to the circumstances that I've got in front of me, or I'm gonna live it according to where I wanna go. Which one will you pick? Step up, get up, do something, and don't stay the same. That's not where you're supposed to be.